you do anything else to spread it? That drip might not stay a drip, is what I'm saying. Perhaps. Well, I suppose I've said what I've come to say. Um, this is a lot to consider. It is, but we actually are starting to get puzzle pieces now from your conversations and our snooping. This Gives is us good. ground to stand knock, on. Knock, 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 knock. I'll write a letter to the major, and I will um. See about that meeting. Maybe oh, tomorrow. Hmm. Uh, I, I need to go to the forest. Uh, I was going to speak to Awen. Um, oh, wait. I wasn't supposed to say anything about him. Oh. It's fine. It's not like I don't trust you. It's... It was a final gift from Yindel before she left. Her and Faye put it together. There's a place I can go to speak with him. And he's got, um, connection to a wider range of things. I was going to ask him about the, about the orcs, ask him about this, um, forget what else, but if you think of anything, he's highly into I think you have time to think, because I put on Markle's sheet to do that Tuesday. I see. Well, I thought that was last, I thought that was yesterday, Tuesday. Yes. I talked to him today. What I'm saying is it was a mistake. It's not ready. All right. Then never mind. Um, I do have to get take care of some things, though. This has been good. We're making progress. This is a good distraction, at the very least. Um, thank you. We're all on the same side, regardless of arguments. We've survived this long. Because of it. It's not going to stop now. If you need us, tell us. If we need you, we'll tell you. No more secrets. From any of us. Right. All right, then. Leave you two to it. Be careful. Will do. You as well. Right. What's the play? We're gonna let some time pass. Smart. Give it another day, see if Marco does anything stupid. If he doesn't do anything by the end of today, we'll know that he understands his role now. Mm -hmm. I was gonna check in with him, but I think he's a little, uh, still frazzled, so I'll leave him to stew for a bit. We don't want to corner an animal too much. No. It gets to a point where someone is so afraid that they'd rather die. We don't want to push him to that. Hmm. I think what needs to be done... ...is we lay low for today. Tomorrow, we start digging about who this Sergeant Niraz is. The one that's pushing people for the protection money. And the one who is harassing and hurting the bathhouse girls. Mm -hmm. He spearheads most of these uh, shakes down, shakedowns of the merchants, yeah. He's... I've been thinking. Mm. If we could... I've spoken to Basil a few times. I helped her with her girls and so on. Mm. If you could get in good with them. They hear a lot of things at the bathhouse, I'm sure. Men in the throes of passion and whatnot. I let secrets slip. Hmm. Maybe you could set something up there, same as you did in Edward. It could work. Unless you think it's too risky. No, I don't think it's risky. I just worry about the, uh... The bathhouse girls, that's all. I don't want them getting any more. Yes, well, I also... I also don't fully trust them. What the fuck? 
Whoa, whoa. Thank you. A tool to be used sparingly. Stupid idea. No, it, it can work. You just have to figure it out properly. It's a lot different than what I'm used to. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I've had to do some things. For the 20 or so years that I was on the run. The Grady is another beast altogether. The values are very different. I've, um... Managed to expand my network of whispers to uh, Alerno and Karano. So we should act as a bit of a warning system in case anything shows expand. up. Expand? Yeah. Which means that you already have something here, don't you? Oh, many things, yeah. You make me feel old and slow, my son. Why? <laughs> You told me to handle these I things, guessed. so I did. I have been. It's hard for me to do. I know. That's Not what I'm good at. Handling it myself makes me feel like I'm putting you in danger. No. The good thing about how I've set it up is that there shouldn't really be any way for it to link back to us. Proxies on proxies and blah 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 and so. Knock 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 knock. And I trust you, and I leave it to you. Hmm. Sounds like we're wanted again. Yes, it's been a lot of knock knocking. I suppose we should get to it. I do need a favor from you. Sure. I was going to take care of it this morning, but I've eaten up almost all my free time. Okay. I need a representative to go to the Carter's Guild and find out what they want for the destroyed cart and dead horse. <laughs> He's sending See me if instead. Can negotiate something. Right, okay. Yes, I am. <laughs> See if you can negotiate something that isn't horrendous. The woman that's there, she's not like the Merchant's Guild. She's very well spoken, which makes her dangerous. Right. Uh, what's a. <laughs> how much are you expecting this to be, and then I can lowball it? I honestly have no idea. I'm. I would rather walk out with owing them work or favor. Okay. Or favors. Because they are a legitimate Carter's Guild. If they want free security for a certain amount of time or something. You know, maybe free metalworking, I don't know. But carts are expensive and I don't want to after all the work we did. Be set back. I understand. Be set back. Oh, uh, yeah. Also, I paid... Neath his cut okay. of three silver and sixty-four copper. I'll take that off our sheet. We have another shipment coming in, same amount as last time. Good. We're a little low on iron, but what else is fucking new? Yeah, I think this is the last shipment of iron we're going to get. That's... Mm, okay. I have to do something about those mines. Carter's Guild is just around the corner, right? Yeah, no, no, I'll bring you to them. Okay, sure. It was like oh. so much knocking on the door. <sighs> yeah. And all, uh, literally all the drow are here. What do you people want from me? Uh, well, I was going to update. Shereen. Oh, she was here first. Give me your money. Shereen, all right. I'm not here for anything in particular. You're in good with the Carter's Guild, right? I like... You want to accompany Actually. me or something? Hey, Sarah, would you like to help an old man settle his debt? Do you need a cart? I can go procure one. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's a problem. <laughs> Speaking of problem, I might be in some... Take uh, Sarah over to the Carter's Guild. <laughs> my come bearing presence. I've heard of your victory. You get first pick. He's carrying a giant orcish sword, an orcish axe, an orcish mace, and a set of orcish brawler gauntlets. Um, God is good. Your choice. Fucking gauntlets away from me. Right. I didn't have war for you, war for Morgan. 
All right. I'll take right. the axe, though. I can knock that down for you. Oh, actually, I think she's about? the person in charge. Can you speak with anyone in particular? Yeah. She is. She's my boss. Very good. One of them. Impressive short. Mm. Excuse me, ma'am. May we step inside? Oh, yes. There's some business that I have some friends that want to attend to. My friends have some business that they want to attend to. That's the proper sense. Attend to your friend's business. Men friend Attend to friends spins. my business I have to get. <laughs> Pretend friends. What have you gotten yourself together. into now? What have I gotten myself into? You know exactly what this is, I'm sure. Considering that I believe I saw the young apprentice. I'll sit Hi. back here. I, I don't... vouch for this young man and his boss. I am only here to help them. I will not be speaking on their behalf, my lady. <sighs> May I? <laughs> I don't think we've talked in a business way uh, before, but <sighs> I am Sharik. I'm the apprentice blacksmith. Um, and as I'm sure you know, we, uh, hired some carts the other day to, uh, transport some goods. And I'm here to see if we can, uh, settle that debt. Yes. Well, what I want first is the story of how they were lost. Okay. Um, we were using them to transport uh, goods out of town along the Eastern Road. Yes, Eastern Road. When uh, basically an orc ambush happened, they forced the carts off the road, damaging them in the process, and we did our best to defend them. Thankfully, we were bailed out by a few mercenaries that we were selling the goods to. And uh, I'm in the process. Oh, well, you were there. How many do you think? 15, 20, maybe? Two dozen, yeah. Mm. <clears throat> Quite a substantial okay. amount. Um, we tried to repair the carts, mm. but some of them are irreparable, and we had to use one of the horses to transport our wounded back to Nortis. We ended up hoofing it the rest of the way, mm. carrying them on foot. And one of the people you had in your party, from what I, I gathered, was Miss Sif. Correct. Correct. That tracks. There was someone that made mention of a bear. Was there a bear there? We had a uh, an accident with the. Uh... Yes, to put it bluntly. Mm. If you're speaking, you're not speaking. It is... Interesting. I was informed by Miss Sif of some actions that occurred. I was unaware that she'd been in uh, contact with you about this. Mm. That is the wonders of a business world. Being able to move around, have your different pieces, and people talk and say things. Mm. That much I'm aware of. Hmm. But yes, we managed to recover a card. Mind you, it was in not good condition. Salvaging pieces and parts. Then we had Miss Sif volunteer to take responsibility for the other part. Um. You see, that's not the problem. Problem is that Tazini and your company, those that were traveling with you, signed out the cards. And 
while it was not in your control, they were lost. So, I will say I am reasonable. I will not charge you per se for the card that Sif will be repaying us for. That's very kind because of I'm you. I'm going to incorporate both the costs of the cards into what Sif is getting. But the horse. Hmm. You know the price for a standard workhorse, correct? A standard war horse? Uh, it's like 50 silver, isn't it? Work. Work. It oh, thank God. Okay. It was war, right? <laughs> no. I wish we had those. <laughs> Expensive was, was investment. Uh, a work horse. Mm -hmm. uh, 25, 20, something like that? Yes. Hmm. 25 is what they tend to go for. Now. I understand that you've had issue getting iron and metals into the form. Correct. So, well, I could charge you 25 silver to replace a dead horse. I'm willing to bargain for other things as well. I was hoping to, actually. So, dealing with silver is an easier way of getting things done versus drawing up contracts for deals of favors and, shall we say, perhaps first purchase order. Mm. Mm. But I want to know what you are willing to give. Before I perhaps set the table. Well, supplies of iron have been rough, else I would have offered to uh, work on weapons for you or repairs of tools and things like that. But they are, as I said, it's hard to get iron to do that, so that probably wouldn't be something we can do. However, we can definitely do basic repairs, sharpenings of weapons, we could definitely handle that for, well, until we pay off this horse. Um, alternatively, I mean, we managed to handle ourselves with these orcs as best as we could. We're willing to provide free escorts of your carts to places, guarding and, and such, until it's paid off. I've got a question hmm. for you that is curious. It is a rumor that I've heard around town. That there was a notice patrol that killed a dozen or so orcs. Hmm? I've... Now, I've seen the soldiers. Some of their equipment is not the best, I will admit. I am curious. How many was in your party when this 15 to 20 small band of orcs came to you? Uh, six, maybe. Hmm. That's what, smaller than a traditional patrol? Hmm? That sounds about right. And they only killed a dozen. We hmm. didn't manage to kill most of them, I should point out. We managed to drive them off, though, once the mercenaries arrived. Now, here's the thing. That might be my query. What if they are just taking responsibility for what they did? Hmm. I would not put it past the another guard to do that. Hmm. You've seen their behavior here in... The city, I'm sure you understand. They're not exactly mm, kind. I had my hand broken by one of them, so no. Does not surprise me. Something they would call you out on a slate, even if it was nothing that you did. I have interest in maintaining relations with all merchants and makers, crafters, whatever you are. 
Your business succeeds, so does mine. Couldn't agree more. But I will not charge you silver if that is something that you would prefer. But having access to your services for getting carts to and from locations, that is definitely something we can do. Additionally, when you do have iron and whatnot, having a small amount of that set off to the side to repair our equipment, that could work as well. We can definitely do that. Hmm. I think this will work. We will have a certain amount of jobs, but you will do. There you are. And it won't be too There's many. the phone. And perhaps if it is a more dangerous job, we can have it. Thank Maybe you, Conley. I'll just put it back here. Extra points, shall we say, into having that debt paid. Of course. I, yeah, that seems fair to me. Mm. Then I do hope in the future, if you think that you're going to run across something, you are a little bit more careful. We try to be. Accidents happen, though, but all things considered. Definitely could have gone a lot worse. Yes, and it would have been perhaps worse to say if you had lied to me. But considering that I had Ricardo and his story, and they seem to line up quite well. Hmm. I have no reason to lie to you. Like you said, no. if we succeed, you succeed, vice versa. I hope this is the beginning of a future where we both succeed. And As again, I do not like having to collect debts. We don't like having to pay them, so but I'm glad we figured this out. <laughs> hmm. Do take care. Thank you. And give to Zim my warm regard. I will. Thank you. I appreciate your uh, understanding. And if you do ever have the need of going out and you feel like there is more than usual, we have good relations with the Mercenaries Guild. So we can get something to pull along with you too, maybe. Hmm. I'll keep that in mind. Thank you. Hmm. Boss. The papers are right up there. So. <sighs> That went really well. Thanks for coming. I'm glad. Mm. You okay? You can trust her. I'm sure I'll be fine. Mm. Rough night. Yeah, you seem a little foggy. Mm. <sighs> blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sure this will cover Miss Margot. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, until you're using it to actually fight shit. Enjoy your day, Mr. Cooper. Actually, right. it's me. That is unfortunate. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, sure. Moment last. <laughs> so, this fire sort of thing could be a bonus. <laughs> well, that man that was here. <laughs> it was an elf a moment ago. For whatever reason, I wanted to know what his fighter gave was. <laughs> Hmm. Does he know the problem? I believe he was the. Why is it not organizing your brain? Um, I, well, I know who I know who he is. I know. Who, I need I know to who talk to you on that scene. But uh, well, yeah. uh, well, yes, uh, I know. Not? On the uh, mm -hmm. west end of Garadia, there's a whole pe a bunch of people that work for that stuff already, isn't there? Uh, also, uh, I talked to Marin. She's gonna have my. Isn't there like uh, my one dynasty? That's the Rosizo dynasty. All elves. I'll be able to work well, on no, I don't think anybody knows that. I think that's a secret. No, I made 15 silver. You can ask me about my own lord. Oh, wow. Nice. No? That's I don't. Wow. Holy shit. Yeah. So I think you're, you're right. I think you're on the right track. <laughs> it's a net profit of five, but. <laughs>
Thank you so much. That's still pretty good. Things need to be uh, like, in, like red text if, if, if they're supposed Indeed. to be or not. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm trying to remember how much I was school. Though I think it says yeah. there that that's all general knowledge. I mean, look at this. That's good. Oh. I swear you said Mr. Me. Cooper, if you drop that hammer off, I can that take thing. care of it and have it ready by evening. Miss Lario? How many times does this guy get arrested every day? Not yet. We've had a busy day. What? What do you mean? I swear, I swear. I swear. No, every time, I, I have some every time I've seen him, he gets, he gets dragged out from the guards. How so much? How much? What are you talking about, Sam? So the price thing, I would give you. Oh, how many pieces? Yeah, there's someone else that wears blue in a... Excuse me. Material cost. Seven silver thirty, nine silver eighty, and nine silver eighty. One for me and one for him. If I may dealt with the plate, I'll go make another. Forty copper. Slippery, aren't you? Forty? That's for two. I'm good at the same way. A four people fill you in. I need a tattoo to go inside. Not at all. Better be quick. He's in his upstairs. Yeah. I tried to disappear and I immediately got back. I know. I handled it. Uh, we owe an equivalent of 25 silver because apparently Sif covered one of the cards. Oh! But, 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 instead of paying that money, I agreed to do repairs on weapons and tools if we can with the amount of iron that we have. And we will be providing um, escort services for some of their carts instead of paying the money. Ah! Fuck! I I mean, that's good. I'm trying Fuck. here. You did. You did fine. I just knew it was gonna happen. Yeah. Fucking Carter's Guild. I'm gonna kill all of them. Really? Hmm. Yes. It's twenty fucking silver. That sounds like fun. Yeah. Are you having debts. a good day? Been busy. Ah. Wonderful. And what kind of dead have you laden yourself in with the day? Paying off a horse. Died by orcs. Money. I see. Work horse or war horse? Work, thankfully. When she said, I thought she said walk, uh, war, war horse. And I was like, holy shit. If it was a war horse, I'd be leaving town. It'd be 50 silver, yes. <laughs> I'd be leaving town and giving them the deed. <laughs> I did what I could. And even then, they'd owe me money. God, I'm gonna listen in on this real quick. Yeah, out in a bit. If I'm needed, you know where to find me. At the moment, I'm just working on all of the orders. You know that thing that you were talking about, about looking for that stuff. Come and get me if you need me, okay? Because I'm kind of interested in that. Well, there is a battle. Well, there's a area of interest not too far that I'd like to look into. So yeah. I'll catch you later in a little bit when you're not. Grab me I'm going to see me. if I can't uh, make some more silver. Good luck. Dignitary or some other nobility lineage um, in Gradia. I think he's seeking help there, or he's dead, and that's a cover. One of the two. Uh, he left uh, with a whole bunch of guards. Uh, uh, so uh up north. Him. Yeah, yeah. He he left, and he's like there or something. Um, by boat or uh, by foot? I I don't know. I assume probably foot. Where um, did he go? Uh, he left to a keep up north. I, I'm trying to remember. Keep um, There's yeah. A castle it's... at the very edge of the province. Yeah, 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 that's it. That on the edge. No, that's what if... the words were. So, if you go down the road that the dip, um, diplomatic center is on, and you continue down that road all the way to the north tip of Nordis, there's a keep on the border that watches the main road coming into the province. Mm. Are you saying he's gone there? Why? There's no one there. Uh, I, I don't know. That is just what Gar told me. Is that a memo went there? Mm -hmm. I can try to. <coughs> yeah. Gar, uh, tavern keep. Gerbum. Oh, Gerbum. Yeah. Okay, so a mem left the castle and went to another keep. 
Yes. On the edge of the province, where another garrison is. Why? Have you heard anything else? Uh, no, he, uh, the girl kind of, kind of got kidnapped by God at the, the, during the conversation. But I plan on getting more information. If there is more information, I'll keep you updated. But this seems kind of relevant. So, yeah. That's um, really fucking weird. Mm, those were tiny uh... notes, weren't they? <sighs> <laughs> I have one more point, but you're really not going to like it. It's all right. Just tell us. Mm-hmm. <sighs> They're looking for you. Okay. Hi. In middle conversation. Thank you. All right. Wait in the kitchen. Um. The last thing that a uh, girl told me. Uh, he mentioned that there was a Arlandi deserter that was posing as a Sardello mercenary. They were captured last night. As well as executed. You heard this from Gerbrum? Yeah. <sighs> Fuck. I'm sorry. Still not verified, it's only a rumor. <sighs> but uh, that is what I had to tell you. It's good that you did. I've got some salt I need to deliver to Laria. Okay, you're not gonna do anything rash, right? If he's dead, there's nothing I can do. Okay. Thank you for telling me. Yeah. I'm glad it came from you. Hi. Yeah, I figured I should be uh, the one to tell him. I heard the rumors too. Mm -hmm. You did? Yeah. Like I said, glad it was you. Yeah. You okay? Yeah, I, 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 just I don't him? know them. Yes, you did. Wait, uh, who are you looking for? Does he... Oh, no, he's upstairs. Oh, he's good. going to be very Should busy. He... We need a word. Okay. And more appropriately, from we needing a word. Change the word, but uh, yeah, you that may want to take her somewhere a bit more. Yes, I'm gonna go continue doing business outside so people don't bother you while this is going on. Give me a moment. <sighs> this is very awkward okay. since uh, the owner of yeah. the house did not invite me, and I apologize. My fucking house. You're always welcome, welcome here, in. Basil. You, you don't get to fucking say that. This isn't your house. Fuck you. No, I know, but he said You're that always yesterday. welcome here, Basil. He said that yesterday. 
Okay. Um. All right. Come. He's going to be very busy, right. most likely. So, whatever I can make this a little easier on him, I suppose. Uh, what do you need? Last night, um, I had one of my girls brought here because this is not like. One of my girls got hurt last night, and Soma was here, so we brought her here. Um, he had requested some names from me, and I wanted to give the one that I remembered, since they paid me a visit this morning. The gods? Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, I can get those to him, I guess. I, I feel bad by messenger when he requested it from me directly. We're working closely together. Kind of figured he considers you all family. <laughs> I could tell that last night. Hmm. Uh, which, by the way, Lily wished that you had been awake when she had woken up in here. She wanted to thank you again. I uh, came down in the morning and she was still here. So, she, uh, we had a talk. I don't know why she... But yeah. uh, it's the type of girl that she is. I didn't really do anything, though. That was Now she's going you. to have to deal with me. I mean, you freed her. I can't even do that to myself. I'm trying. Yeah. I just burnt her. I don't know why she... I can't even get my... Yeah. She's a brave girl. And the fact that she can keep cooking after after everything. What do you expect? Um... I'm just going to give you a name. And then I'm going to go so that way it doesn't cause any issues. But... Uh, one of the guards' names is Selene. Uh, three brothers. Two of them look basically identical. Selene? Selene. Oh, okay. Stupid. I called him Salam earlier. You called him Salam? Uh, there was so much going on. They were telling me that I was at fault for it all, so. You don't think you're at fault, do you? What can I do? It's kind of hard when they only started. And, uh, you know. Started when I stuck up for her. So, I kind of do. Yeah, how dare you look after your friends? That's all I had to relate to him. If you can get that to him, um, I'll get it to that him. That would be wonderful. Of course. Thank you. Let me know if you need anything. <laughs> Sorry and again. Like Torty said, you're always course, welcome um, here. I'm still sorry for barging into your home. It happens Usually, on a daily basis. So I wouldn't worry about it. <laughs> I like being invited in. Then consider because it, it a pre-invitation. Because it makes you feel like a person. <laughs> Thank you. Of course. I will use your back door here. So that way I don't cause any more issues for you all. Have a good day, Basil. You too. By all means. Who you would like to accompany me, miss? Mm. You can use my house if you need to, so... No, no. Be a wee wee one. Hmm. 
<clears throat> have you eaten? Yeah, have you? No. Lardy is bringing me food, though, I think, so. What is a biscotti? I have no idea. Hmm. You're not wrong. Things have been rather lively around town. Uh, it's no joke. Everyone's just trying to scrape by. Most of them manage. My head hurts so much. I'm sorry. Maybe food will help. Yeah. <clears throat> I need to sit down somewhere. Want to go to the tavern? Pop a squat. Pop a squat. Sure, if you want. We can go somewhere. <laughs> I kind of want to lay down, I'll be honest. <sighs> this is your forge. You can lay down if you want. It's so de- Oh, God. You alright? <laughs> I think I nearly threw up. <clears throat> it's so dirty on the floor, I wouldn't. Maybe you should take a moment. It's okay. It's just me squatting down and standing up just made my stomach go. Mm -hmm. <sighs> um, the fuck is Ladio? Bring me food. Yeah, when you get your food, we can find somewhere for you to get comfortable. Yeah. How's your day been? Uh, you described it earlier pretty well. Foggy. Foggy, yep. It's weird acting like everything's normal when... What happened yesterday? Yesterday? All of yesterday. Mm. The cellar, just with Mirandelle in general, I mean Bessram in general. It's a lot. And then for today to be so... <clears throat> quiet. Did you hear the rumors? I feel like... 